So Highball Halloween is uh, a masquerade festival and um, a celebration of fashion and creativity uh, that results in a fabulous party in the Short North Arts District. You know, it started as a way to um, celebrate what we do here in the Short North, which is a component of it is fashion retail, a component of it is arts and culture, and a component of it is, you know, just celebrating uh, entrepreneurship here in our community. So Columbus is this, um, you know, in many ways emerging mecca for uh, fashion design. And what costume couture does is allow them to, to kind of come out of themselves a little bit more. Is everybody ready? My name is Kelly Martin and I have a clothing label called Anti-Label. Hi, I'm Lauren Prim and I'm a technical designer at a clothing company here in Columbus. Hi, I'm Ira Texan and uh, I am a design assistant and also a production assistant at a local costume manufacturer. I, I went into this not really knowing exactly at first what they were going to do. I kind of already had my four-piece mini collection designed. It's going to be very ragged, a lot of layers, a lot of dark prints. Um, they're really going to look kind of like the victims of the bubonic plague. So it ended up being really cohesive. I think our narrative for this character is basically she's like the soul collector of like all the victims and um, she starts absorbing parts of them. My name is Annie Wyrock and my brand is called Rock and Loyalty. My design aesthetic is it's a little bit edgy but it also has a lot of feminine embellishments. The character of my costume is kind of a mixture of steampunk meets the Great Gatsby roaring 20s and It'll be very glamorous, over the top, and glitzy, and she will be carrying a martini while riding up in the sky in a hot air balloon. My name is Aaron James, and I am a self-taught designer. I've been designing for about five years. My design aesthetic um, tends to lean toward glamour. Lots of bling and uh, sequins and details. It tends to have a bit of a 70s or 80s flair to it too. A little bit retro. I'm kind of taking inspiration from uh, the Hunger Games type of eccentric, um, apocalyptic, modern type style and I am going to kind of fuse it with the concept of Poison Ivy from Batman. You know, it's, it's really about the fantasy of it. And, um, you know, some folks you think Halloween and they take it to that spookier, darker place. Uh, I don't think we had any zombies on the runway this year. We encourage kind of the exploration of, you know, the over the top, the, the fantasy, the, um, the exciting kind of uh, couture element of it. So I think folks explored all sides of, of what that Halloween holiday um, showcases, which is um, transforming yourself for a night or a weekend, in the case of Highball, um, to, to be creative.